Hi guys, this is uh, David Kolachi again with my new video on schizophrenia. Uh, those of you who know me, uh, you know that I, I, um, I am um, uh, ex-schizophrenic. I had uh, accused schizophrenia some uh, seven years ago. Uh, it was uh, not treated by the uh, medicines. Uh, it was uh, treated by, by, my, by me, by myself, uh, throughout the other means. Uh, throughout the other habits, other uns, but but definitely not with the uh, medication. I did not take any medication right now, and uh, I took medication. Uh, you know, doctors put me on medication for uh, some time uh, previously, but it did not help. So I cured my schizophrenia by myself, and I have made a lot of a lot of videos on schizophrenia, uh, how to treat schizophrenia, whether it's a uh, uh, catatonic schizophrenia, paranoid. Uh, hallucinations, delusions, um, acute schizophrenia, anything you mean it, you name it, you can treat without the help of medication. What happens with the medication, those who are affected uh, with schizophrenia, you know, by uh, taking medication, uh, you know, it, it, it does uh, kind of, uh, I mean, uneasy, uh, it gives you uneasy feelings, it makes you heavy. Uh, your head, your body, it makes, uh, makes you heavy and it takes a long time before you get any uh, effects of that uh, medicine before it works on, uh, on you. So I would suggest do not take any medicine uh, to cure uh, schizophrenia. Uh, you can go through my other videos whereby I have, uh, I have talked about many ways, uh, easy ways by, you can do by yourself to cure your schizophrenia forever. You do not have to be schizophrenic anymore if you follow uh, the instructions in, uh, in my other videos. See, the doctors, they do not know uh, what schizophrenia is. I mean, they, they do know, but then uh, they have not been through uh, this situation, this situation sales. So only the people who have been through this situation, they will know very well uh, what, uh, what had gone uh, gone on uh, what what goes on goes on and what are the things we feel what are the things we you know uh, we go through so these are the things if like I am ex schizophrenic so I know very well what it is and how it is it is painful uh, to be uh, in a schizophrenic uh, condition so like I said always it is not a disease it's the uh, condition which you have to uh, treat all right um, uh, what I'm going to talk about today uh, in my today's video is that how to eat and what to eat. So eating habits will really, really, really go a long way in uh, curing your um, uh, schizophrenia. So um, the first thing what you can do is you have to eat green things uh, and sour things, green and sour. Uh, for example, uh, you have to eat uh, grapes. You know those uh, choose those uh, green grapes, the sour ones. Uh, of course, the ripe ones, but then uh, they have uh, you know um, taste of uh, uh, sourness. So you have to take those uh, uh, grapes, uh, sour grapes, um, and you can uh, eat them um, uh, as many you like, or you can make a drink, make a juice out of them, and drink at least two three glasses a day, and. Uh, uh, well, this is what to eat, and then another thing is what you do not have to eat is sweet things. Avoid sweet, even even if they are the um, uh, the fruits. I would not suggest uh, eating sweet fruits. So avoid sweet fruits, avoid sweet things, and that will go, you know, against you. Those sweet things will go against you definitely. It will uh, it will benefit your uh, evil spirits who are sitting in your in your body in your mind. So they will uh, they will. Uh, uh, benefit from uh, you taking uh, sweet things. So go for sour things, grapes, and uh, do not eat mangoes. I mean, I, I do not suggest uh, eating mangoes because mangoes are um, sweet. So they will, they will not do uh, anything uh, to you. So another thing what you can do is you can eat a little bit salt. Uh, take a little bit, you know, just, just a little, a, a pinch, or just just slightest uh, pinch. And you can just lick on it, and you can you can have it three, four times a day. Do not go for uh, too much uh, um, salt, as you know it is a cause of uh, blood pressure and all that. So this uh, the diseases are not uh, 
uh, anything which you, which you know which you can afford to uh, have in your in your body so that's uh, those are the uh, things which you can uh, eat and those you cannot eat so you can think of other sour things which you, you know the best uh, so you can you can take a lot of them sour things they are good for your body they will strengthen the the point here is that we have to strengthen our bodies rather than weakening our bodies rather than uh, uh, profiting uh, the evil spirits so we have to profit the evils they cannot stand the uh, sourness of the uh, fruits or anything else which is sour uh, naturally naturally sour so you can uh, safely go for those things and uh, i'm very sure you will benefit a lot of a lot from that now those of you who do not know what is the cause of schizophrenia the uh, cause of schizophrenia is the evil spirits who come and sit uh, in our bodies and in our in our mind for long and uh, they they control us they possess us so once they possess uh, we become schizophrenic so we are controlled by them they are the ones who rule our lives uh, rule our mind rule our bodies uh, and uh, give us pressure give us trouble make our life uh, miserable so uh, so the basic thing is you have to chase in uh, sometimes uh, you know some cases uh, i think in most cases very very difficult to chase these evil spirits they are in layers they are many 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 in our bodies if we are schizophrenic depending on how severe our condition is the more severe like acute schizophrenia more severe our condition is uh, more evil spirits are there in our in our uh, our bodies so they are in layers they do sit in our bodies they they can come into our bodies without telling us without letting us know and they stay in our bodies for long and then they control our mind our brain so i was uh, uh, affected by this uh, schizophrenia very badly very badly you can you know i i am i can say you know i mean i can say that i'm very very proud very brave that i fought with this uh, uh, schizophrenia i fought with these evil spirits they used to taunt uh, they used to call me names you know all the the names all the dirty things they used they are basically dirty the evil spirits they talk about dirty things they talk about um uh all the dirty things all the nonsense uh just to uh, hinder you just to give you second thought in your in your mind so that you cannot focus on uh, anything which you are doing so this is a reason uh we cannot focus on anything because uh, the presence of uh, these uh, evil spirits evil spirits in our in our bodies so i do i i uh, in my other videos i have talked a lot about uh, evil spirits they are for real they are there and you have to kill them uh, in order to be schizophrenia free and killing the evil spirits you do not have to worry about anything killing the evil spirits is pretty easy if you follow the steps i have i have listed in my other videos and even in this video uh, over a, t a period of time it takes uh, uh, maybe a month three months six months uh, a year depending on your uh, condition so if you follow the right steps uh, that will be a step ahead so you will never look back uh, on to your uh, schizophrenia so day by day you will get better and you will feel better you will be uh, under your control so you will gain back your life from these uh, evil spirits so uh, the evil spirits are enemies uh, to us humans so we have to kill them uh, if they disturb us so in uh, in uh, schizophrenia people have a uh, uh, different kind of uh, uh, perception that uh, if we are men uh, if we are male uh, the female uh, uh, evil spirits will uh, sit in our bodies if we are female the uh, male evil spirits will sit in our bodies well there's there's this contrary i mean there's that's a myth it's not true so in, in male uh, they can be males uh, in female they can be female uh, evil spirits so that's uh, you got to clear out your mind and the one thing is you have to believe if you want to cure your schizophrenia you have to believe in evil spirits they are there but then you do not have to be you do not have to be worry about uh, about them you do not have to be scared of them that's the last thing you can do if you are scared of your uh, schizophrenia if you are evil spirits so if you are scared they will be stronger you will be weak 
So do not be scared of any evil spirits. You can kill them. You can finish them. And this is this is what they deserve. So we have to kill these evils. So uh, till my next video, um, I will say bye bye. And like always, uh, I wish you uh, happy life, schizophrenia free, happy life forever. Take care. Bye bye. And do not forget to subscribe to my uh, channel and like my videos. Thank you very much. Bye bye.